Good morning, ESM. Today we've got some exciting information about how you can get involved in our school newspaper, as well as a bit of a preview of what we've got for you coming, of what we got coming for you next week. But first, let's go to news and announcements. In news this morning, Wegmans is set to expand to another two-story store. The store would be located in Connecticut and would be 95,000 square feet and include a multi-level parking garage. Colleen Wegman, president and CEO of Wegman's Food Market, said in a statement, Each year we receive hundreds of requests from residents for a store in Connecticut, so we're excited to bring Wegman's to Norwalk and to get to know our neighbors. In other news, Russia attacked Ukraine's nuclear plant as invasion advances yesterday. They shelled the facility and set off a fire. There is no major alert of any nuclear problems. There was a phone call between U.S. President Joe Biden and Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky. The U.S. Department of Energy activated its nuclear incident response team as a precaution in response to this call. It is the second week of, second week of attack from Russia. The eastern city of Anor Hodar and Zapro Zia's nuclear plant was the one attacked by Russian forces. Recent events in Ukraine have hit home for people in the ESM community who have family currently in Ukraine. To stay connected with these events and opportunities to show support, a Google Classroom has been established by Ms. Butanko. The classroom code is IKU2NLS. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. There was a little announcement made before break, but in case you forgot, the Spartan Express is an online newspaper written by student journalists that cover an array of topics. They've got tons of different kinds of articles, from informational pieces to reviews and opinion pieces. This month, we have an article written about the Winter Olympics, St. Patrick's Day, our upcoming Greece play, and some of our school athletes and reviews of some popular shows and movies. However, our student journalists aren't the only ones who can contribute to the website. So can you. Starting this month, they are looking for other students who have heard, have seen, who have something to say and want to be heard. If you have something you want to share, feel free to send it to the staff of Spartan Express, where it will be looked at, possibly featured next month. Additionally, they are looking for featured, feature student artwork. Their email, spartanexpress at esmschools.org, is open to submissions of articles and artwork written by the rest of the student body. They're also taking art submissions, so if you'd like to see one of your art pieces on the new page, make sure to talk to your art teacher. If there's something you don't see and would like to see in the next update, you can also send them ideas, suggestions, and feedback as well. And with that, on to weather. Um, today it will be mostly sunny with a few clouds. Today we will have a high of 34 and a low of 17, and tomorrow we will have a high of 43 and a low of 40. And I'm Abby with your weather. ESM Central High School. My name is Phil Januszewski and I am one half of the dynamic speaking duo known to the world as MMP Presentations. Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Matthew Makovich from MMP Presentations. I am beyond excited and thrilled to see each and every one of you virtually. Now friends, we are coming virtually on Tuesday, March 8th to see each and every one of you in your individual classrooms. That's right to lift you up, to have some fun, and enjoy that beautiful day together. We're gonna have a great interactive time talking about how you, yes, you my friends, each and every one of you are completely unstoppable. I need you to rest up, I need you to get ready because we are beyond honored to celebrate life with each and every one of you. 
Now we're working on that Spartan pride, my friends, and we're breaking it down in fun, simple ways that can help us move forward and upward in our lives, especially during these unique times. From your friends here in Chicago, all the way out to Syracuse, New York, we're sending you love, health, happiness, patience, and peace. And we hope you have a great day from your friends here at m and Presentations. Boys and girls unified uh, bowling teams play at FM at 3.30. Tomorrow, three ESM track athletes will compete in the New York State Championship meet. Michael Parks will complete, compete in the 55 meter, meter hurdle high jump. Rocky L will compete in the 55 long jump, triple jump, and Kevin Hasey will throw in the weight throw. Once again, back or ideas, you can email them at spartanexpress at esmschools.org. And if you have a piece, an art piece you'd like to send, and make sure you talk to your art teacher. Next week will be the start of Pride, so Monday will be all about the P in Pride professionalism. That's all we have, I have for you today. So from everyone here at The Morning Show, have a fantastic Friday and a great weekend.